The Chief of Defense Staff, General Christopher Musa, has stated that the military relies only on intelligence it can get from the people, saying the military cannot be everywhere. General Christopher, during a courtesy call on Governor Caleb Muswang of Plateau State on Monday, said that the military are not magicians, noting that the recent bombing in Goza and the Polka towns of Goza local government area of Borno State were meant to embarrass the government. The defense chief assured that the perpetrators of such evil acts would not succeed while calling on Nigerians that the responsibility to secure the country depends on all the residents working together with security agents. I want to assure you that we are truly committed in ensuring that there is total peace in the plateau. Nothing will stand in our way. As long as we, it is possible, we will make it possible. So, sir, you will always count on us. We will always be there for you. We want to thank you very much for all you have done and all you have done. And uh, to assure you that uh, we will continue to be committed. We will go around and see the improvements that we made, especially the recent uh, eyes in the air that we have, which will also help us in conducting our own operations. Uh, now, what is going on, and this we can see where what is happening in life. And that to direct also that like, instead of spending trying to find out where things are happening, you can just go directly to such areas. Things are within us. They sleep and live within us. If we report as quickly as possible, actions will be taken. The members of security cannot be everywhere. We're not magicians. We also rely on the human intelligence we're getting from the people. And that's why I want to call on Nigerians that the responsibility to secure Nigeria depends on all Nigerians working together with the security agencies. Following the directives of the president that peace must return to Plateau, we are glad that the right attention is being given to Plateau. Uh, we are hopeful that these efforts will continue to yield better results. Like I said, we are better off today than where we were last year. And our hope is that as peace returns, of course, then the presence of the military will reduce. When the presence of the military is reduced and we can sleep with our two eyes closed, that's when we know we are, we are, we are living in peace. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.